I told everybody I'm on a different path this year, more positive. You are nothing. You're suing the family for nothing. You have nothing. If you have a chest or a jar or a bell in your hand, then you have something to fucking argue about. He's sending our emails out to the public. Now he's going on Facebook, intertwining us to our profiles of our Facebook. This is what this motherfucker's doing. Now, Street, am I wrong in what I'm saying right now? No, not at all. He has went way over the line and is making delusional, absurd... Um, allegations, and then grouping all of us, just because we joke around and say, yeah, we're in Chase Lake, you get paid, he thinks we're actually fucking telling the truth. This is entertainment. This is a... what? What's the category of your channel, Greg? Uh, mine's comedy, I believe. Mine's entertainment. So there you mine's go. You comedy. comedy. Comedy and entertainment. Yeah, mine's comedy. I mean, and, and my whole... Hey, Luli, thank you for joining us. Hey guys! So, good to see you. <clears throat> and good to see you too. So, I want to finish what I got to say. So, Dave, if you got a fucking problem with me, call me. You have my number, you've been on my show. But do not, do not fucking send my business. This is my business, my email business. Okay? To fucking whoever the hell you're sending it to, all courts or whatever. Because now you're pushing the line. I think what it is, is you're backed in the corner. You have nothing left in life, just like Barbara got defeated. Do you want to test that water with me? Because I'm going to tell you right now, fucking David, you test that water with me. You're going to find out how fast fucking Barbara got shut down. You're going to fucking get shut down. Because isn't it funny that a judge stuck up for me? That doesn't have anybody protecting them. <laughs> so if you want to play this fucking game of who I know and who I don't know, let's go, Dave. So you better knock it the fuck off. Now I'm pissed. Because that's some bullshit, people. How, how this shit is going on behind closed doors that nobody realizes in the community of what is really going on. Leave the fucking family alone. Either they know or they don't know. We don't know. We don't have nothing in our hands. And my opinion on it is, like I've said before, I'm 50-50. 50% that force fucking led fucking Jack there, okay? To protect the family. And left the original at their original spot. Well, if your dumb asses aren't getting off your fucking lazy asses and out there searching, it's your fucking fault. He left bells, he left fucking jars, he left everything out there. So if you're going to keep complaining over a fucking a box when there's many things out there that he left for the community, and that's my opinion. I'm not telling you to go out there and search, but that's my opinion. If your dumbasses want to keep fighting over a goddamn box, keep fighting over it. Look like fucking idiots. But at the end of the day, don't be fucking attaching hundreds of people on fucking emails and putting them there. Greg, I guess I know what is you wanted to know about. My opinion of what Dave Woodard is doing, uh, I believe it is very calculated. Uh, it is wrong. It is extorter, extortive in manner, and it serves no good purpose whatsoever in this chase other than for him to attempt to get something he does not deserve. Exactly. But when we got when we have a search person, Dave Warder, sitting there sending emails and putting business emails out there and sending it to courts and newspapers and stuff like that. We got a fucking problem, everybody. This is what this community has I mean and I'm not sitting here saying that Forrest Finn was perfect and I'm not sitting here saying the Finn 
family is perfect. Nobody's perfect. I'm not perfect. Nobody is. So anybody in the chat, you're not perfect. I can tell you everybody in this chat community and everybody in this panel has lied once in their life. And a great example is you lied to your kids about Christmas. I'll leave it at that. But at the end of the day, don't sit here and point fingers at everybody when you're sitting on your ass behind a computer and you have no evidence. Nobody has any box or second box or whatever. Some of us believe in a second box. Some of us believe in a title. But the whole thing is, at the end of the day, the family still has not been able to grieve. Now, if you want to believe that the family is doing shit illegally, that's fine. But don't attach hundreds of people to emails, to courts, to stuff like that. Don't be a fucking Barbara Anderson. Don't be that fucking crazy fucking bitch. Don't be that, everybody. You, Everybody's better than this. It's like, I think you get rid of one witch and everybody, now we got David over here. It's like, Jesus, everybody, let's go. Stop the fucking shit. Get off your asses. Go out there and try to find answers like I'm doing. I'm in Colorado right now. Get out there. Find some fucking answers. Sit, stop sitting here going through articles and this and that and all this bullshit. Go out and explore. He told you to get off your asses and, and enjoy life. But all I see is, bah, 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 bah. Come on, people. And then I got people sitting there emailing left and right the courts and shit. And then I get, and then they order, I get a fucking phone call from a judge that I know, you dumb son of a bitch. This is how dumb you are. I know the judge. And he calls me. You look like a fucking idiot. You look crazy. Stop with the bullshit. Yeah, this is a rant, okay? This is a rant. Don't worry about it, everybody. This is me ranting a little bit. I'm on a different path this year. Like I said before, I'm just enjoying life, and, and I'm still searching for my nine clues, and I'm still thinking there's bells, there's jars out there. That's me, okay? I'm doing it for me. I bought property in New Mexico because of Forest Fan. I'm going to dig for artifacts. What the fuck are you doing? At the end of the day, what the fuck are you doing? Think about it, Dave. You ain't doing nothing but suing for $20 million. I called you out on a fucking video. What were you going to do for the $20 million? You said you wouldn't even share it in a roundabout way to the fucking community. You're suing the Fenn family, but you aren't going to share it? Oh, this is my fucking... I lost my movie deals. I lost everything. Get the fuck out of here. Lily, what do you think? Well, you know, I, I had blocked Dave a while ago and, um, I, I, I didn't get, I didn't get the, uh, the, that original email till today. I didn't see it till today. I knew it was out there, heard about it from a couple people, but, um, yeah, I'm, uh, Dave's in a lot of trouble. What he has done, what he has insinuated, putting my business email in there and this sort of thing, and then naming us, all of us. Um, he's in a lot of trouble. He really is. And, uh, I'm, yeah, I was upset about it, um, for sure, you know. I didn't really, like I said, I, I didn't see it. I had to unblock him so I could see it. But because his, I know his stuff for a long time has just been nonsense. I really don't want to hear his crap but yeah he's just really trying to do everything possible to get attention for himself obviously but i mean so. i mean i mean enough's enough i understand when somebody's cornered and you know what i mean okay i've always been the brute of truth i've always brought it to everybody okay i'm not on the fin side family i'm not on our side i'm on my side and let me make this fucking clear to everybody. I'm not on the fence side. I'm not on my side. Well, I mean, everybody else said. I'm on the side that Force said, get off your ass and enjoy life. And I'm enjoying life. I'm traveling. I'm seeing things. But when 
I see people doing what they're doing and what Barbara fucking did for two years to this whole community. None of you, most of you, I would say 80% of this community didn't do shit. All they did was sit back and they fucking didn't do nothing. I had my people that 